Hi, this is Bill for SparkyChannel.com. Today I'd like to introduce you to the Ego 21 inch self-propelled 56 volt cordless mower. This mower has an electric motor that can produce 2800 RPMs with no load and it has enough torque and power to equal most gas lawnmowers. The battery is located right here where motors would be located on most gas lawnmowers. To access the battery, you just lift up the panel and you push this in pretty hard. It comes right out. And here is your 7.5 amp hour, 56 volt battery. To install it, just put it in like that until it clicks and close it up. This panel will protect the battery and so forth from water splashes. It's not recommended to hose this mower down, but it is protected from water splashes. To turn the mower on, first depress this green button, which is the on button, and then you pull back the what's called the bail lever. And that starts the motor. So it's like this. To turn it off, just let go of the bell lever and it will turn off. This lever right here is for the self-propelled function. Right here we have a speed lever. For less speed of the self-propelled, you pull this back. For greater speed, you press all the way forward. So maybe I'll put it right about there. Right out of the box, the mower is equipped with a mulcher. And you can just pull it out like this. You see, the mulcher diverts the grass clippings down onto the yard. And this is what the mulcher looks like. It just comes right out. The mower package also includes a side discharge unit. To use the side discharge unit, you put this slot in, in this little pocket. You put it in here like this, and then close the lid. In addition to the mulcher and the side discharge unit, you have a two bushel bag. And to put it on, you lift up the lid, Put the latches right there, and you have a nice two bushel bag. When you buy the unit, it's gonna look like this. It's gonna be all folded up. And what you do is pull the uh, lever right here, and the handle comes right up, like that. When you buy the unit, it's gonna come looking like this. It's all folded up. And just press this latch right here, and the handle comes up. And then you undo these latches. This handle extends like that. You put in the latches again, and now you can adjust the height, uh, which is a really neat feature. If you're really short, that's good. A little higher, 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 and just get it where it's comfortable. Make it like a one notch lower. Okay, that's right where I want it, right there. That's, that's just right. This self-propelled model weighs 62.6 .6 pounds. They have a model just like it without the self-propel, and it weighs 55.3 pounds. This mower with a 7.5 amp hour battery will get 60 minutes of runtime with a light load. It'll get 45 minutes of runtime with a medium load and 30 minutes of runtime with a heavy load. And by heavy load, they mean uh, like a, a tough species of grass, high grass, uh, wet grass, something like that, something to make it a heavy load. This mower has headlights. You just press the headlight button and your headlights come on. You have six height adjustments to get your deck up off the grass. So the first one is an inch and a half and it's number one. And to use the lever, pull it towards the outside of the mower and then over and back into the slot. And so that first one was one and a half, this one's two inches. The next one is two and a half inches. It helps to pull this up when you're doing it. There, it's easier. So this one and a half, two inches, two and a half, three inches, and we got three and a half, and we got four inches. So you got six different height adjustments. You see, we're much higher now than we were when we started, see? And all four wheels go up at one time, which is just a fantastic feature. For, for my lawn, I think I'll, I'll go with number three. When the mower is in storage position, it can be lifted up like this, and just cart it around, just like a dolly. Okay, and I know you're gonna wanna know how big this is for storage reasons. 
So it's about 37 inches high. The width is about 21 and a half by including the motor, about 13 inches. Here I am mowing a thick overgrown lawn. The thick grass is not slowing the mower down at all. To me, it feels like I'm using a quality gas mower but without most of the noise. I'm surprised at how quiet it is. I found that the self-propelled feature is really nice and I like that the self-propelled speed setting is easy to change while you're mowing. I found that a low speed setting was best for this job. Also, the self-propelled feature can be used by itself without the blades going. This is great for taking the mower back to the garage or shed when you're done mowing. A higher self-propelled speed is good for that task. When you're done mowing, it's advised to wipe down the undercarriage to prevent a buildup of dried grass. Blowing the mower off with a blower is also a great idea. A fast charger is included with this package. It's fan cooled and will charge a four amp hour battery in just 30 minutes. In conclusion, I'm very impressed with the power that this mower has. I love how easy it is to insert the battery and how the battery and motor are protected. The controls are all at your fingertips and easily used. I love how the fold up system allows you to store the mower in a relatively small space. The mower can actually fit in this small Rubbermaid shed. I'll put links in my video description for the Ego self-propelled 21 inch lawnmower and for the lighter and less expensive model which is not self-propelled. I'll put a link for a new Ego lawnmower that comes with two 5.0 amp hour batteries instead of one 7.5 amp hour battery. I'll put links for an extra 7.5 amp hour battery and for an Ego 5 amp hour battery. I'll put links for other great Ego lawn maintenance tools such as the Ego chainsaw, the Ego blower, the Ego hedge trimmer, and the Ego string trimmer. Thanks! I hope this video was helpful.